how to make pensive punch. Got a house full of thirsty wizards? Quench their thirst and help them relive their favorite memories with this delicious recipe. You will need photos, a large bowl, non-toxic craft paint, a smaller clear bowl that holds at least two gallons, clear tape, three quarts of orange juice, two quarts of pineapple juice, two liters of ginger ale, a food coloring set, heavy duty gloves, three to five pounds of dry ice, a cutting board, an ice pick or hammer, and sherbet. Optional, clear plastic wrap or plastic baggies. Dry ice can burn bare skin. Always handle dry ice with heavy duty gloves. Step one, collect photos from the party attendees ahead of time. They'll serve as the memories for the pensive. Warn people that their pictures may get wet, so they shouldn't contribute any family heirlooms. Step two, using the non-toxic craft paint, decorate the outside of the larger bowl with magical symbols and wizardly words. Step three, tape the photos to the outside of the clear punch bowl facing in. To protect the photos, cover them in plastic wrap or put them in plastic baggies before taping them to the bowl. Step four, mix the punch ingredients, except for the sherbet, together in the small bowl. Add several drops of various food colorings to give the concoction a murky color. Step five, wearing heavy duty gloves, place the dry ice on a cutting board and chip half of it into manageable pieces with an ice pick or hammer. Put the pieces in the larger bowl. Step six, set the punch bowl inside the larger one and pour warm water in the space between the bowls, creating an eerie vapor. Add additional dry ice and warm water as needed. Step seven, scoop sherbet into your spooky punch to give it a sugary kick and enjoy. Did you know? Pensive comes from pensive, meaning deep in thought, and sieve, which is a device for sorting a mixture.